Good morning, church. It's so good to be here with you all today. In case I haven't met you yet before, I am Sarah Lynn, the youth director here at Salem. Before we get into the message this morning, I want to take a few minutes to share some news about what's happening in and around our church. First, I would like to welcome all of our first time visitors. We're so glad you're here. We hope you feel at home. Please take a few minutes to fill out the connect card that is placed in the front pew. Also, Chuck Womble will be in the connect room today with information and signups for the upcoming construction mission trip to the Ivory Coast in April. In June, Nicholsville mission trip will happen and that will be in Virginia. Please stop and talk to him about serving on a mission project. It's a life-changing opportunity that I can vouch for, especially if you love to help people and using your talents and God-given gifts to serve God and bring others to Him. Unfortunately, we had to cancel Wednesday night activities last week because of the snow and the ice. But fear not, our fearless Pastor Doug braved the frigid water to baptize a man who was staying in Warrior's heart and accepted Jesus while attending our church. I'm getting chill bumps just talking about it. Oh, and Pastor Doug, you would do great in the polar bear plunge which is February 3rd. Hey kids, Miss Kareen is anxious to start kids choir practice on February 7th at 4.30. This is open for um, kids in grades kindergarten through fifth grade. The worship choir will start practice on February 4th after the worship service. The youth will have another volleyball tournament again at County Line on January 26th. Now let's get back to worship as Pastor Doug continues the series, Fear Not. Today is Focus on Today. Remember, God's got you as you embark on a new year. Don't spend too much time living in yesterday's sins or successes. Let the worries of tomorrow be dealt with tomorrow. Instead, live in the moment of today and give God all the praise, honor, and glory. Have a great Sunday, everyone, and thanks for listening.